Hey guys, Will from Next Performance and today we're just going to do the incline dumbbell press. So Mickey's going to demonstrate for us. She's going to pick up her 10 kilo dumbbells there. Uh, the incline I usually like on 30, 45 degree incline. You don't need more than that. Uh, it's almost going to be an overhead press if you go higher than that and any lower than that is pretty much going to be flat. A little bit of angle uh, at, on the bottom pad is uh, it really helps get your hips in a nice good position. Uh, and other than that, when she lays back, the feet are going to be, the shins are going to be vertical, feet nice and flat on the floor. The her cue for her feet during this to keep tension is going to be pushing uh, uh, down and away, almost like a leg extension into the ground. Straight away, she should feel some quads from that, staying nice and tight through the hips. The hips, I, I don't want you to be arched like you would in a competition bench press. Um, so if you have this tendency to go up like this, just keep them nice and they don't have to be tucked fully or anything like that, but they, uh, I want them neutral. Same with the shoulders. I don't want you to be big arch, shoulders back and down. You don't need to be here. This isn't a competition bench press. Uh, we just want to be, we still want to be retracted to some degree, but uh, we want to be somewhat flat. Uh, and I'm not that concerned with holding full retraction as long as your shoulders aren't dumping forward, which we'll talk about now. So as she goes through the press, let's go press. Should finish up just above your shoulders. Shouldn't finish straight out in front of you or above your head. Just want it here. As for the angle, I'm not too concerned. I don't care, neutral, 45 degrees, pron fully pronated. I don't really, not really concerned uh, as long as what it's, what, do whatever's uh, most comfortable on your shoulders. From here, I'm gonna slowly go down. You can go elbows right out to the side, elbows more like 45 degrees in. Again, I'm not really concerned with whatever's comfortable on your shoulder and whatever you feel most in your pecs. So go down. Yep, nice stretch in the pec. When you feel that stretch, you go back up and squeeze through your pecs. Through here. If she goes too far, if she goes too far, she'll roll forward through the shoulder. We don't want to see that. If that happens, you're going to end up with some really angry shoulders and you're not going to be able to lift a whole lot of weight anyway. Let's go down, get a nice stretch at the top. The only other thing is the breathing at the top, same as a normal bench press. Take a big breath, fill up this upper chest area, hold it go down and then on the way up exhale one more rep hold tension big breath go down nice and controlled feel a stretch in your pec exhale and press that's it for the incline dumbbell press if you have any questions shoot us a message